today I'm doing my morning routine and this is my skincare routine. I hope you enjoy so let's get started. This is the Inspired 10 Step Korean Skincare Routine. It's not all Korean and I don't think there's a fully 10 steps. I'm not too sure. You must count and see. Um, and yeah, so let's get started. I'm also going to be explaining why I was away and um, why I've come back and all that stress as well. Good morning, guys. I just got up and finished my cupping for the day. This is a different day, but I want to show you my skin after. It's like hella dewy, hella glowy really good i leave it on for about an hour and a half and then i wash it off in the shower in the morning i do some cupping i love cupping i do about half an hour of it to an hour if i can i use coconut oil here is a little video of me like really early in the morning i look out of it and i was um of me doing some cupping but i do it for about 40 minutes is my average time an hour if i feel like it i try and do it every day if not every other day i've noticed a lot of benefits from it my face has been tighter firmer bouncier um less lines so i really am actually loving this So I don't actually like to have this on for too too long because it can clog my pores up. I like to use some of this which is, which is the Clavive Milk Cleanser. This is great for dry sensitive skin. If you do have just dry sensitive skin I would not recommend anything else apart from a milk cleanser. American brand but they're Korean inspired. It's really great. I love it. It's basically their whole line of things. So I do a pump in this when I'm in the shower and I actually leave this, I like leaving my face bare in the shower. It's really actually bad for your face and strips your face and it's like really hella bad. I use my green tangerine moist cleansing foam um, from Goodall. This, I love this. Can't say cleansing foam properly now because of SF9. Um, I'll put the clip here. So, I love this. It's really hydrating. I'm literally up to here and I've had it for months. Pumper. Um, you have seen this in a video where I got this scent. It is so bad for your face to make foam on it. You are literally doing this to your face. So making it in here is a lot more gentle because you're literally then just going. I use is the Zoe. Now this is actually run out of like battery and things. So well it kind of broke it was my fault they always say keep this on and i didn't because that's the bit where you charge it and it got water in it so that's totally my fault of these they're so good um this one is anti-aging side and this one is a deep cleansing side with the vibrations you can turn it up like actually so it's like <laughs> get out of the shower i tone i don't like to leave my face no more than five seconds without anything on it i don't like to let it get dry with the water basically i also don't use a towel um i just pat my face and i don't use a towel to wash it because there's no point whatsoever towels and tissue papers just clog up bacteria my dry skin life and you're like just seven skins of toner has changed your life yeah it has and if you have dry sensitive skin if you get the right toner that isn't stripping or isn't i'm not saying this one might not be but i'm just saying if you get the right toner that has oils it is the first thing that you put on your skin after you've washed it so think about that so i'm back from the shower and i'm gonna go on to the next step and explain why i went away Essence, I'm using the Karataka, the white DNA cycle essence. 
um, this helped with skin cell turnover and you guys know I really highly agree with skin cell turnover it works amazingly so I'm gonna get started on why I was away I went away because um, of college I was at my finals I was very stressed we had a lot of editing and a lot of paperwork to do and then media so um i was very you know kind of a bit stressed there and then i kind of forgot about youtube like no offense because i forgot that i started it again and then i went on a holiday so i didn't film then and now i'm back so that is that i don't know how often i'm going to be uploading the least every other week the most twice a week that's what I'm kind of going for. When I get in the gist of it, I'll obviously let you know a little bit more. A nighttime routine is a lot different, so if you want to see that next, let me know. I'm now going to be using the Mario Vadescu eye cream. I really like this. I don't have too bad eye circles, as you can see. They're a little bit, you know, dark because I don't get much sleep, but they're not really bad. So, this is perfect for me, but if you have really bad ones, probably not going to be the best. I haven't noticed too much of a difference to be honest. The cupping has helped more than the eye cream. But it's really hydrating, so again, if you have dry eyes like me, quite a bit on, I like to let it sink in and massage in when I'm doing my skincare. I use their vitamin C serum. I have noticed more difference with this than I have the cream. Brighter, whiter, uh, and dewier. Since I've been using this, I really, really like it. Quite a lot, I would repurchase this. As you guys know, I have got all these products sent to me, but they're not paying me for YouTube to do this. So I, this is my full opinion. That's what I said about the eye cream. Not the best at, actually making a difference but hydrating it's really great so i just wanted to let you guys know that i always never forget your neck i basically do all of my skincare routine on my neck as well now when i don't have time which i know today i'm on a very tight schedule i will pack it into my skin if i do have time i like to let it sink in for about five to three minutes each step so i like to really let it sink in but if not just really press it into your skin and it will do the cut the same thing but not as good now oh, my ample right here i'll show you how to make that in another video it is so good and as you can see i've got a huge tub out of it and um, it's probably my best tip ever but again i'll save that for a whole different video everywhere and i like to actually do a whole job on my neck just because it is a diy one and the stuff in it is so 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 good a whole drop on my face uh, it just feels like you put a whole new layer of skin on it this one so refreshing and amazing and hydrating and then i get about this much hold it like this and do it on my neck once i get out in the shower and i actually get to just the bathroom area bit i spray my face straight away i don't leave it any more than like five seconds ten the most um, without anything on my skin i love the seven skin step as well because you can do it while you're doing things you don't have to spray it seven seven at a time you can do two and then another two and then another two so you've got to like tidy up the bathroom you can do it like that that's how i do it and then i just spray my last two and walk to my room and by the time i've walked to my room it's dry I like had a chat with myself and went through my old videos and i was like you used to have so much fun doing this and you had literally next to nothing um products and makeup wise so i thought why am, would i not share these products that i get sent through instagram with you guys this is the can't read it without my glasses on lip blanca green tea it's an emulsion i got this then probably two months ago and i'm only here and i use it day and night what the heck this is not going down an emulsion is great if you have oily skin i'd highly recommend getting an emulsion it's honestly so great for your skin it is meant to do is it is meant to hydrate your skin but not you know like a cream or anything it is a step in between creams it is that's what it's for it is to lock all the other creams in before you put your main cream on top that's what i've read anyway no 
basics of it. I pack this in and then I just wait a little while because you are actually giving your skin layers and layers and layers of hydration if you are dry this is what you need and if you are oily that's why I recommend the emulsion because it is so great I've never felt greasy with it but I've never felt tight with it either Next, my skin has um, changed so much while doing this as well. This is Pure Life Aloe Vera Gel. Now, when I don't have time, I don't do a thick layer. And I did a thick, thick layer last night and it's so nice. Rub it in. And if I don't have time, as I said, I'll just take my ring finger and keep rubbing it in um, until it's not like a thick layer that you can see. If I do have time, again, I do a huge huge thick layer that will last like 20 minutes this is great if you don't have a sheet mask as well um because it's aloe so there's nothing bad about aloe i love the fact that the reason why i love this is it dries my products down really quickly but it doesn't dry it out so i don't look oily but i feel very hydrated the aloe is super hydrating it is super calming for your skin if you have dry sensitive skin like i do um it is so great for that <laughs> lastly claviv they sent me their whole skincare line on instagram and they sent me their sheet mask as well which i want to do a review on here and um, this is a protective day cream I'm bringing, this is probably one of my favourite sunscreens that I've come across, I love it. It isn't actually called a sunscreen, it's got SPF 30 in it, which is great for England, we never go higher than that. It's a protective day cream, so I'll talk and put it on at the same time. It is not thick like a sunscreen, it's just thick like a cream. I really like it and you know that you put in an SPF 30 on your skin. I haven't had any too much flashback whiteness with it um which is great but it's just so nice and not oily not greasy not pore clogging in any way i actually find that i don't have to wash my face as much and i'll get to that in a in the evening time routine so you guys that was my routine i hope you enjoyed it was just me a bit of a chit chat and an explain video and yeah that's about really i will see you guys again very soon hopefully next week while i get into the swing of it and yeah i'll do my nighttime routine if you want that as always comment down below your favorite skincare i always like to get into skincare so let me know that and i will see you guys very very soon goodbye